and welcome back to a, another video on this transit recovery truck so I'm not sure what order these videos are going to go out but at the moment I've got the prop all split up I've ordered bearings for it and um, just waiting for them to come obviously before I can do that so today's job I'm going to make a start on cutting out this rusty section here to open the door so you can see it better I'm going to cut out this section fabricate a part and we're going to get that welded in if I've got time I'll look at pulling out this dent as well and um, I'll show you how I'm going to do that I may do a separate video as well so we'll crack on with that and uh, set up the camera on the tripod start putting this out lifting the uh, plastic trim up Here. And it's actually not that bad, I don't know if you can see in there. The step's not bad. You need to get a new door rubber. Alright, so the welding needed a bit worse than I thought, so what I'll be doing is cutting it here. I think maybe a little bit closer over here. Well, that full panel off. I'll just have to do a couple of bends here, so it'll probably be a seam at some point. But then on the inside, it's it's gone a little bit. Now eventually, I am going to put a step in. I will put a new step in. So I'm not too sure whether to just to patch this for now, just to give it some rigidity, or whether to to leave it. I'll uh, I'll decide once I've put this section out here. Right, so I'm going to make a start on, on getting this section here cut out. So I'll just cut a small section out first, see what we're left with. And then I'll, I'll have a look at what's, what the best option is going to be moving forward. see the sill wasn't really connected so all I'm going to do is plate it across here all the way across just to connect that up plate the inner sill there and then rebuild the sill around here right, so here's, here's my first template so we'll get the inner sill don't know if I've got it on my own get the inner sill cut out in metal get that welded in first then what I'm going to do is potentially work on on this section here just plating it as I say for now and then we'll start working our way but I'm not going to be able to do that in one piece but hopefully I can get that bend on there try and get this this sweeping bend to here so we can do this section I'll, I'll probably do this little bit here in one piece and then another one there. I don't think we've got the, uh, the skill level to do all that one. Right, so I've cut out the first, first bit of metal. Just used some, some scrap steel that I had um, and that'll be welded in something like that. And then we'll start building the rest of it. to uh, gobble that in it's, it's solid but it's a bit rough because uh, 
made a bit of a mistake on the welder. I've been welding with flux cord, so I had the uh, clarity the wrong way around at first. So I swapped it around anyway, it's, it's absolutely solid, which is, which is all that matters. The welds on the inside of the sill anyway, so I'm not too concerned. I'll just make sure the next bits are a bit neater. I'm only going to grind down the bottom bit where I'm going to do the, the join. to just take a little bit more off this and then we'll look to, to it. Yeah, so I've got a um, first piece tapped in as you can see so shut the door
thought I recorded that, but I didn't. Um, just want to come out a tiny bit more. So that's where we've got it to. Obviously that needs welding up there. These all need knocking off. A little bit weld needed in them two holes. But we've got more of a, a line going down now. Loses there, but it has had a, an arch on it before, so that's on both sides. I'll sort that when I fit my new arches over time, but for now, we're getting there, we're getting more presentable. There's the, the repair on there. Sort of blended it into what was there as best I could. That'll get a little skimmer filler, skimmer filler up there, and obviously into the door. I've just banged on the first coat of uh, filler. Got around there, done. Knocked out the bottom of the door. As you can see, the door sits flush now. I'm just cutting this into the video. I went and put the phone on charge and then came out and carried on doing a bit more. So what I've done so far, I've put a skimmer filler down the arch, rubbed it back, got most of the shape there, and I'm just put the second skim on now. Got the door in, so pretty close there. Open the door. Ready for sanding down there all underneath been done as well. Put a plate in there as well. So that's ready. And then I've made a start with the, got the DA out with some, whatever it is, there it is, with some 120 grit. And I've just started taking some of the, the chips down on the paint. So started up here. Yeah, so I've got a pair done started rum down i think i've got to order some more filler anyway so i think i'll probably get rid of most of that dent um when i do it i've got a bit of plastic primer so i think i'll just do these in in body color as well i'm just going to mask off this door seal because i, I don't want to be taking windows out on the bonnet i've got to get a bit of filler in there because it's just a little bit low we've got it's had a little bit of filler work done in the past, which I don't mind. So carry on flatting this down tomorrow, um, fill that in, touch a bit of primer on where it needs a primer on the bare metal. Just show you this side, just made a little bit of a start on this wing. I've got this here, but I don't want to take, I've not got the time to take all this stuff out. I need to get it just in colour, so I'm just going to have to leave that for now and come back to that at a later date. And basically, I just need to, it's all these chips here in the paint, which are back down to the white, that I'm just planning on getting off with the, the 120 grit. See around here and all around here. Dinted the paint there. So... I'll, get, I'll be on with all that tomorrow. Once um, once I've got it flatted off with the, the filler as well, I'll go over the, the whole thing again with 240s, then I'll give it a quick blast with 400s before I decide to uh, put a quick dust coat of paint on. I'm not bothering with the door shuts other than down there. Um, I just need it looking a bit more presentable. The bumper is going to need some some work on it i considered actually buying a new bumper for it but for what it's worth i'll i'll rub it down get it in color all right so that's the first video on the transit doing some actual work on it let me know what you think of it i know it's not a professional job but i just want to get it on the road for now um door's going to be straight get it all filled up get it sanded off then we can start working on getting this car painted in diamond white please do like share and subscribe thanks for watching